Hello, friends and lovers. Welcome to Balatro 1.0. That's right, it's here. I am so excited for this. I have been waiting so hard for this game, whatever that might mean. I have waited incredibly hard for this. Anyway, we got it one day early because the developer was nice enough to throw us a key ahead of time. They did not pay me to play this game. I just really want to play Balatro, of course. <laughs> I have put something like 60 hours into the demo, and I have already played a little bit of 1.0 leading up to this just to see what's on offer here. And I got to tell you, this game is massive. This game has so much content. It has a ridiculous amount of polish, quality, variety. There's so much to do. You have to play Balatro if you have not played it yet. You just have to trust me. Okay, let's get into our run, shall we? Let's take out, I'm thinking the Nebula deck. This is going to be one of the new ones that I don't think we've seen before. Start run with the Telescope Voucher, minus one consumable slot. Celestial packs always contain the planet card for your most played poker hand. And we're going to play it on the base difficulty, but uh, yeah, you can see this is what the first difficulty looks like after that. Small blind gives no reward money. That's pretty big. That basically means one out of the three rounds, you will not be given any money as a reward. You can still earn interest, though, per round. Might incentivize skipping, too. It also says applies all the previous stakes. Probably kind of similar to the Ascensions in Slay the Spire, right? Where all previous Ascensions get applied, you know? Anyway, let's hop into it. We're going to do it on that base difficulty and just kind of have a nice casual run, I think, for the most part. So we want to focus in on Celestial Packs and Cards and try to play a lot of one hand, if possible. Shop as a red joker, we probably would not be able to afford it. So a lot of the sta same strategies are still going to apply. I think you can... Can you hold sixes for a full house here? What else do we got? I can't remember. I know. It's something I should probably just know by now. A jack and a ten will do us, though, now. This is not good enough, really. Hmm. I think I'll fish. I'm not sure if this full house score is high enough. I can never seem to remember. Oh, it does. Okay. So the sixes were probably fine with something worth 10, right? Drunkard. Yeah, we're going to see a lot of new stuff here, of course. You know, there's tons of new jokers. There's new... Um, Gosh, what else is new? I mean, it's mostly just new jokers, but also the blinds. There's a lot of new, uh, like, boss blinds and some other... I think there's some new skippy things, too, as well, as far as I can tell. Some new vouchers as well, too. Okay. Plus two multiplier per reroll in the shop. So I guess we can build up rerolls, maybe. Plus one discard permanently is nice. There's no celestials here. We don't really know what we're doing otherwise. That's a new one, I think. I think that's what it's trying to say. I can't totally tell. For every reroll, this gets plus two multiplier. And the antis go up to eight now, by the way. So a long-term joker like that might help us out a lot. That is a lot of money. I think we can do that. I think that's worth it uh, this early on. Minus one hand size might be kind of painful here, though. And da -da -dum. what do we want to do, we think, here? A couple of fives ain't great. Maybe go for a flush? I'm kind of thinking. Hmm. Hmm. Reverse that flush, kind of, I think. I think you do do this. Uh-oh. She ain't happening here. I don't think you play those, though, still. Okay, we got something. We are very close to a straight, but I think you still gotta just play the flush. We'll probably get out of this if we started with that. Now we just gotta play our best hand each time. Hmm. So you play a pair and you chuck back cards we don't like. There's three queens in the deck still. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to select that. A pair of twos is definitely not worth a lot. Okay, that's a little bit better. We only got two hands left. And I don't think a pair is going to do it. Okay, I think we got to fish for a straight. There's three kings in the in the deck still. We got to play this. Pray that we draw a king. Oh my god. Never punish. This game is actually pretty hard at this difficulty. Even as someone who has played quite a bit of the demo. I think I, I've actually lost quite a bit. Possibly from greed. I don't know. <laughs> We're going to need a little help along the way here. I really want that paintbrush. I think we can say. So our most played hand, it's just one across the board. Um, so this is probably not quite worth it. We just don't know where we're going yet. I don't know 
we could try to roll like once per shop i don't know there's some vouchers that make rerolls cost less there's some jokers that make rerolls cost less too we probably need a little help right now the fortune teller could be good later but it's not great right now so i'm thinking we got to take raised fist so i think we buy that and i think we buy that for now to survive polychrome joker i think i have to not take right now we got a really nice flush here actually I say really nice as if one's better than another, kind of. <laughs> I think you... No, you play the six. I'm sticking about raised fist here. This might be worth enough, as it is. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Yeah, that'll carry us for a little bit, but... We want something a bit longer term, eventually. Death card is really nice. Temperance, uh, we make a dollar extra back, right? Um interesting the order here i think we want to go this way first in case we get a joker out of it hmm it's kind of tough to know the order for this okay so we could glass something but i don't think glass is great unless you're just going for your own personal high score so i think we just go judgment that's not a very good one that's for sure Rated tarot card if poker hand contains an ace or a straight. So raise fist. I'm oh, sorry. I might be glossing over some of the facts here. Adds double the rank of lowest card held in hand to the multiplier. So you want to hold only the highest cards, preferably. So now we can use temperance to get a little bit of money. I don't think I want to use that for anything yet. I think I don't roll here. I know. I know. We got this joker, but adds an extra voucher, huh? That's pretty expensive. We kind of just need to earn money right now, I think. Okay, we got a full house in hand. It's too bad we have this too, huh? It might be worth actually discarding it to help raise fist. But I don't really want to discard anything else. There we go. It's an even better full house now. I'm going to hold on to that to duplicate something better. This might be worth enough. Not quite. Oh, not nowhere near quite. <laughs> okay, so now we need something else. Eight, six. Okay. Hmm. No dice. I'm trying to keep an eye out for other hands. I tend to get tunnel vision, though. I'll admit it. I'll admit it. Hmm. Not much here, huh? Could play a two pair along with the four. It's not worth a lot. But it kind of sets us up for another hand after. We're quite weak right now. Okay, that was worth quite a bit just because of raised fist, mostly. Okay. I got to keep that in mind. Scholar. Played aces give plus 20 chips, plus 4 multiplier when scored. I do like Scholar here. We got a Spectral Pack. And then we can start duplicating aces, perhaps. I know this is supposed to be a telescope run, but we haven't really done anything with that yet. I like the... I like, I like Scholar. Maybe we can make use of Super Position now. Hmm... Let's open the spectral here, I think. Oh, we got some interesting stuff here. So we could copy this ace. Make two additional copies of it, right? We could also... Foil, hollow, or poly the ace. And then hope to duplicate it later. Or we could make a copy probably of... Would you go flash card? Probably. Probably. And then we really prioritize it. Oh, man. This is a tough choice. Which means we have to roll like once every shop. It's very... It's kind of... So basically it costs us $5 a shop to get plus four multiplier if we duplicate this. Hmm. That is fascinating, isn't it? $5 for four multiplier. But it also takes up two slots. I could also duplicate Scholar. But we're kind of far away from Scholar doing a lot yet. This is a tough choice. Lots of good options here, basically. I would say. I'm thinking we go... To try to do as well as we can, I think the safest option is to get into duplicating the aces now. So let's duplicate a two, right? We want to get rid of low cards. Either way. Let's do that first. And then we're going to use Cryptid on this. Because we need to get aces in the deck. 
You know, we can't just go full greed and just hope that everything works out immediately, right? So we probably are going to get into like four of a kind or or five of a kind. So I guess buying celestial packs right now doesn't make a lot of sense. You could buy this and sell it for a dollar later. What's the purpose of that? I don't know. <laughs> All club cards are debuffed. Okay. We have a flush. It's too bad we got that too. Maybe I discard a couple things here real quick. It's a pretty strong flush though, right? Okay, that's probably good enough. We now have a straight... It's very close to a straight flush, obviously, but I don't think we it matters. I think this might score enough anyway, if I were to guess. Wait, what? Oh, raised fist doesn't work if the low if it's on if the lowest card is debuffed. Okay, I actually did not know that. Oh, that's a bit frightening. Hmm. Three is pretty bad. So why don't we play... I think this is going to be better than even a full house here. It's so raise fist with the seven. I mean, this should be fine. Yeah, it was fine either way. Oh, wow. Okay. I guess I didn't realize that. Okay. Plus 13 multiplier for each queen held in hand. It's kind of hard to make work, I feel. Banner plus 40 chips per for each remaining a discard. Plus one card slot available in the shop. That's pretty strong, especially if we... If I ever eventually start rolling the shop. Let's see if we get some money out of this bad boy. I might sell this if we get something like that. Mm, no dice. So I want to... Hmm, what do we want to do here? Just make a lucky ace, maybe? We can start converting into clubs. Hmm. Because eventually, by the end, you might just want to try to have a bunch of uh, aces of the same. So I could try to do that. We already have a bunch of diamond aces, though. Yeah, let's just make one lucky. I don't think tower is a good idea, generally. We will buy the buffoon pack, too. We just beat a boss, right? We did. Hmm. Earn one dollar for each nine in your full deck at the end of round. Currently four dollars. I still feel a little weak, honestly, but we did duplicate some aces, so maybe it isn't as bad as I think. Yeah, I could use some economy right now, right? Do I buy this now? I think we wait. We gotta earn that interest. No, thank you. Mega buffoon pack is okay couple aces in here. One dollar. So we can discard the nine too. That doesn't matter. A pretty nice full house. It's probably fine, right? I don't know how much it's worth, really. Can't really tell. Whew. Okay, that was good. Cloud nine. Giving us four dollars a round is pretty decent. That's probably not really worth it. Plus 12 multiplier of plate hand contains a three of a kind. It's pretty good. Do we need it right now? I don't know. I need money is the thing. Okay, that's money. But we also have an ace. I think we need the money right now more than anything. Right? And maybe then we can actually make use of flash card. Make use of overstock. I think you still want to open this. This Joker gains plus three chips per discarded spade. Suit changes every round. I don't love that. Adds one stone card to deck when blind is selected. Ugh. And I don't like any either of these for our deck right now. That's so few. Okay. Oh, so it builds up permanently. So maybe you wouldn't pay that much attention to what you're discarding. Maybe you would. Yeah, maybe you would. I guess we can keep it over that. That's for sure, right? Maybe. I kind of want this too, though. Maybe flash cards burning us. Do we give up on it? Hmm. Hmm. It's quite early to potentially make use of that. 
I might forget about it very often, though. Plus three chips per discarded of a specific suit each round. Hmm. I think this will be too slow. I think it's time to ditch it. So we're going to ditch that. We're going to buy that. And I'm going to buy this now. Anything good here? No, we don't need that. And then nah, it is a no. Yeah, no half joker. Okay. There we go. Now we don't have to think about the, the build. The building up the rolls there. It. I mean, I think it would be good in the super long term potentially. But... Hmm. Adding nines to the deck if for if possible would be nice. Wow, look at this. But there's no aces. <laughs> that is quite a hand, right? That's like a double straight. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> so you could play a low straight here if you wanted. Raise fist would hit something, but we don't really get anything else. They want me to discard spades. I guess I'm going to discard all this. I know, I know, I know, but... So it changes every round. So now I have no more spades, unfortunately. We got to get rid of the low cards. And try to find at least three of a kind on aces, if possible. Okay. Yeah, this should be a pretty solid hand here, right? I can't discard any more. It's only at plus three chips. I might have missed a king at some point. I can't remember now. Okay. By the way, spoiler alert, believe it or not, legendary jokers exist in this game. They do. I've only seen it once. I don't know what caused it to happen. I don't want to say too much more than that after that, though. Chance to create a tarot card when in any booster pack is open. 50% chance, huh? Hmm. Contains a straight. Played face cards give plus four multiplier when scored. Random tarot cards are very strong, I've, 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 I've found. I still feel like the castle kind of sucks. I don't know how the rest of you feel. Hmm. I want to keep Cloud9 for economy reasons. I think I'd r rather generate random tarot cards. I think we take a 9, right? Hey, we got one already. We take a nine for cloud nine. That's fine. I mean, we want aces more so. Oh my God, it worked. Wow. The wheel actually worked. Let's go. Now we get an extra dollar. Aces or nines here is what we're looking for, basically. Nice. We got a hanged man too. Look at that. So we can destroy some low cards. A hollow king? Yeah, you take it because we could get a strength tarot card and make it an ace eventually. I think that's fine. Let's go next. No repeat hand types this round. Okay, that shouldn't be too bad for us, right? Okay, but what's going on with, uh... What's going on with, like, these straights that they're throwing at me, huh? Hmm. No matter what, I'm gonna have a four here, probably. So do I just play this? Do you think I have to play two hands, realistically? To win this? Or could I get better? I think I'm going to play it safe and play a straight to start. All right, we're looking for aces. We're supposed to discard. Oh, right, I got rid of castle. Never mind. I'm happy about that, honestly. Four, five. Yeah, you just ditch it all. Okay. Hmm. Play a straight with a ace. Bet there's a five here, huh? Da -da 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 -da. Got a nine instead. Okay. Oh, wait. I already played a straight. Thank you for reminding me, game. I knew something was wrong. I, I, felt, I felt it in my bones. Okay. We don't have a flush. Play a two pair like this, I guess, is the best we can do, right? That's my fault. Okay, it was enough anyway. It's kind of close, though. Money. So I played a lot of straights. Remember, this is supposed to be a telescope run. 
it is supposed to be a telescope prime. We just don't have a lot of aces yet. This is part of the problem. Plus 100 chips if played hand contains a three of a kind. Nah. Yeah, I just don't think we're going to play a lot of those in the long term. Hopefully. If it was three of a kind, four of a kind, those are the celestial packs we're kind of looking for right now. Nice, we got another one. Wow. No aces. No nines. And these are probably worthy of just skipping. Wheel! Nope. By the grabber. Yeah, well, I think we start cracking these partially for a hallucination. Four of a kind is here. Yeah, we're kind of thinking long term now. We want to try to get a lot of aces, basically. I don't think so. 100 chips? I don't think so. It could be better than raised fist. It could be. Right? I think it's just kind of weak long term either way. Is the way I'm looking at it. Is there anything I have to think about here? No, not really. Let's get rid of the lowest cards. Da, da, ba, no. We got to straight again. I think we just got to do better than that, though. We got full house. War of a kind. Something like that, basically. If the game wants to let me. Ah, okay. So I think you played this full house because it's better for raised fist. I'm pretty sure. There we go. We're fine. Fine design. Okay. Yo, 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 yo. I've never seen this one. Times three multiplier if played hand contains a straight. Oh, it just doesn't suit us at all, does it? I've already kind of started going one way and I feel like it's not going to work out. We got a glass card here, but I don't know if I actually want it. I don't want to destroy my aces. Temperance for 12 bucks. Or double tarot cards. Hmm. Really got to start generating more aces somehow, right? I'm going to go for this. Oh, I only have one consumable slot. I kind of forgot. Crap. And that's because, uh... The deck that we took. Crumbs. This is a double... That's a skippy, for sure. Ugh. Rough one this time. I think I do buy that. One free reroll per shop. Ah, Imagine. You know what I'm thinking of, right? The thing we gave away. Uncommon joke. I feel a little weak right now, not gonna lie. This is a pretty solid hand already. It might win it for us, I'm gonna say. It did not. Oh, it was so close, though, wasn't it? It was so close. I don't know what's with the game, but it feels like it's really giving me interesting hands here. Okay. Two pair, justice. I mean, you could use this on a card we want to get rid of, potentially. I don't know if it's that interesting, though. We got strength. Oh. Death. So we saved this to turn some kings in, I believe. Death on something like this, right? That's the way to go. We need more aces. Big time. Bigly. If I buy this... Hmm. I've already leveled up four of a kind a few times. But I've never played it. So if I buy this, we're guaranteed to get the full house, which is probably fine, I guess. We could glass... No, way. I can't buy that. So if this gives me one of these, it's not going to work, basically. Yeah, we can level up full house for now, too. Just to kind of help us along. Let's get maximum interest value here. All hearts are debuffed. That's fine. Nice. Couple kings right away, baby. Let's go. So... 
the question is we have telescope do i want to go straight for five of a kind or four of a kinds i guess ideally we do five of a kind and start seeing if we can get that to a place where we can uh level that up constantly with celestial packs very early maybe even flush five would be nice plus 20 multiplier for four of a kind that's probably that that's going to be better than raised fist assuming i get it of course right <laughs> will that happen is another question i still kind of like hallucination i want to keep it it'll help us generate more uh aces in the long term hopefully right reroll boss blind one time per ante ten dollars per roll i hope i don't need that you don't know what it is yet um by that first we got a hanged man we don't want either of these no nines no aces nothing basically spectral could still be big you got immolate destroy five cards and hand gain 20 dollars. there's only one ace that's pretty good purple seal to an ace no or something else destroy one random card in your hand add four random enhanced numbered cards so no aces basically destroy one random card in your hand add two random enhanced aces i think that's the way to go right i think immolate is actually not a bad idea either but we're gonna go this way for sure nice we got rid of oh no we got rid of a nine damn it <laughs> this isn't amazing we might get rid of that relatively soon i think right is it even worth rolling here like what could happen right now i don't know What's our ace situation? We have 12 aces in the deck. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah, it's kind of hard to... Since our consumable slot is full, it's kind of hard. I don't think I want that voucher. Definitely no to that. Okay. I guess how many... There's a couple twos in the deck. Only twos. I'll get rid of twos or threes, but I'm going to... Uh, for the hanged man. Yeah, I'll be a little stingy about it. Does that mean I actually hold a three here? I think I do. All right, we have a bunch of aces already, so we can just get rid of our two lowest cards here now. Destroy. Doesn't matter the order here, as far as I can tell. I guess there's a chance that this would not be worth enough. <laughs> okay, never mind. We have two utility jokers I have to keep in mind. Hmm. Hmm. Hair, no. Splash is definitely a no. No credit card. Let's open up that. We did get one. Empress. Okay. Planet X for the five of a kind. Let's go, baby. Let's get that started. Yeah, with one consumable slot, this is probably the next Joker to go, right? We got an ace. Okay, let's take it. Just take an ace, I think, right now. It's kind of hard to roll because I already have something here, right? Like, what could I get? A better joker is probably this. Yo, 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 yo. Hearts and diamonds count as the same suit. Spades and clubs also count as the same suit. Um, That's a bit tougher for us. Stencil joker doesn't really make sense. Um, You could go for flush fives right with this potentially i think we're too far from it it'll do essentially nothing right now most likely i think it's a pass no straights plus four multiplier for each card at below 52 in your current deck that could be interesting in certain decks but not for us <laughs> okay let's go great two common jokers no thank you Okay, so we're looking... We don't have raised fist anymore. Okay, please. We don't have to worry about that. Let's enhance a couple of more aces. Should be a pretty juicy hand. Could be more than fine, right? Let's go, let's go, let's go, baby. We're on anti-5 here. Two pairs, no. Ooh, baseball card. I think I like baseball card. We only have one uncommon now, which is cloud nine. 
but I think I like it. We can try to work around it. You know? Uncommon Jokers each give one and a half multiplier. That's really strong. So Cloud9, right? So we got to hold on to Cloud9, which I kind of was planning on anyway. I guess you don't do that yet, right? We want to open some stuff first. I think I might want Burglar. Maybe? When blind is selected, gain plus three hands, lose all discards. All face cards are drawn face down. It's quite good, and it's uncommon. There's some instances where it's a bit wonk. It, it could hurt you, I think. We don't really have anything that scales with discards or anything, though. So I think we will end up taking that. But I guess we open up something like this first to see if we get anything out of that. We did. Stencil is not good. This is not good either. Yeah, stencil doesn't really work. It is uncommon, but it's not going to work, right? Because it requires empty slots, so it doesn't make sense. But I'm still going to sell this now. We're going to take that. And we're going to sell it. We'll open up this now, sure. No nines, no aces, we skip. Maybe I did that in a weird order, but here we are. Uh, <laughs> um, so we want baseball. And I guess we ditched Zany for the burglar now, right? Something like that. Okay. And we are willing to ditch this for a good uncommon after this. I think this looks pretty good. All face cards are drawn face down. That doesn't matter. So we have no discards. So we mostly just want to play... Well, we do want to keep in mind that we are we have telescope to some degree, right? Hmm. Which is kind of anti-synergy with Burglar, which might require us to ditch a bunch of cards. I have a Glass Ace? I don't remember Glass... Oh, it must have been from that Grim. I kind of want to unglass it, to be honest. Because I want to conserve it. I don't want to lose any Aces right now. It's a bit too risque for me. This should be a pretty nice score, right? 61k. Hmm. Do -do 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 -ding. So I'm looking for uncommons. We don't really want any of that. Yeah, that's a no. Tarot cards appear two times more frequently in the shop. Um. We're probably taking that. Aces or nines? No, I skip. Hmm. It's a bit greedy to go for something like this and hope that you just get strength. I think I'll just take the ace. Okay, now we can throw out one roll. Definitely not supernova. The sun, huh? The sun. I see no reason to do that, really. I think we just go next now. No skip. Okay. Okay, so I actually don't want to play a full house here because I want to try to get five of a kind above full house, so we're guaranteed. So I'm going to play a three of a kind here. So yeah, we're going to play a lot of garbage hands now, but that's okay. Very nice. Should be worth a plenty. Hmm. I'm willing to swap out Cloud9 for the right thing. Yo! Let's go, let's go, let's go. Each played Ace. 2, 3, 5, 8. Gives plus 8 multiplier when scored. And it's uncommon. This Joker gains 0.5 multiplier for each card sold. Resets when Boss Blind is defeated. Meaning when I sell a Joker? Sold. Like, you can sell Jokers. You can't sell anything else. That's probably what it means. Either way, I don't want it. So I guess we get rid of that. The Minach. Okay. Um, we'll open up that. There's an ace. Wild. Good enough. Hmm. We will level that since nothing else is worthwhile. Not gonna roll here. As a voucher, it's quite tempting. To be honest. That one's a bit more tempting, I think. We'll play a straight. 
since we haven't played that many, right? Three of them. Okay. We haven't played a lot of high cards yet either, which is kind of lucky. Even that was worth quite a bit, right? I could play a flush here, but we can just play high card. We want to try to get as many five of the kinds out there as we can. It should be a pretty decent score now with Fibonacci and everything. And baseball. We're baseballing. Baby, baby, baby. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Mars doesn't do a whole lot for us anymore. It's just a waste of money now, right? We should be getting five of a kinds. So spare trousers is uncommon, but it's not good. Banner is useless because we... Oh, it's common. I thought it was uncommon. It's useless because we have no discards because of Burglar. But yeah, I'm willing to sell Cloud9 for something soon. So Full House and Five of a Kind is tied now. Ace. Yeah, I'll still take a Glass. That's fine. The Red Sealed King is kind of interesting there. There's Planet X. Beautiful. That only appears if you played a Five of a Kind hand. For the run. Four of a Kind again. No. Doubles all listed probabilities. One in three becomes two in three. So it's talking about if we still had that card that generated a tarot card one out of two times, it would become two out of two. So it's a hundred percent chance. This would become a hundred percent chance as well. That's a really interesting joker. We got our money back here. Earned one dollar at end of round, gains two dollars when boss blind is defeated. So this is, I feel like the wording on this is a bit confusing. What it means is that that earned money goes up after you defeat a boss. So you earn a dollar per round. When you defeat a boss, you earn $3 per round. Or defeat another boss, you earn $5 per round. It'd be good, but we're kind of late in the run now, I think, for that. Tempe. Tower is a no. No, 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 I think. All face cards are debuffed. That is absolutely fine by me. Play a high card hand here. Should do fine, I'm going to say. What do you think? <laughs> and this is officially in the lead of full houses. I believe. There is going to be endless, by the way. And I'm going to take this run as far as we can. But I'll let you know right now, it's probably not going to get super far. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is going on here? We got some interesting looking things here. Gains plus three multiplier when any booster pack is skipped. So if you open a booster and you hit skip, this gets plus three. This is actually quite good, I think. Early. It's too late. It's also only common for baseball cards, so, so no. I don't think we ever would play Scholar, by the way, even though it's only common. Death is very good for us. Fool is very good for us right now. I can't have both. So I think you just play this right now. Right? What is this? Planet cards in your consumable area give one and a half multiplier for their specified poker hand. That sounds insane. But you also need to get exactly the planet card you use. But still, that sounds pretty silly. We do want this to make more aces. I will open up this. Yeah, these are no's. That's a skip. Spectral. More aces or something. Add foil holographic polychrome to one card. Add a red seal to one card. Ooh. Red seal has to be better here because it'll double trigger Fibonacci and Scholar, right? Let's go that way. I think it's better at least. Convert to diamonds. No. Stone card is a no. Let's just go next round now. No double tag. We want to convert a good ace. Hmm. For death here, right? Oh, the red sealed one I just did would be best. Let's play another lousy hand then and take our time kind of here. Um, Just counting like the hands we've played. Be careful here. Yeah, I know it's costing us money, but... There's the glass. I don't want to double the glass, though. Hmm. I don't think so. I want that one. For death? 
Be greedy. Will a pair of aces win? It might. I'm going to play a single. Didn't get it. High cards at four. I know I'm only playing three at a time right now. Still didn't have it. Hmm. Copy the glass. I don't know. For fun, I guess. I'm not going to play the glass cards right now, though. I'll save it. It's just taking too long. I'm wasting money. All right, all right, all right, all right. 14 didgery dollars. Oh. You kind of make your money back. Gains time 0.2 multiplier for each time a lucky card successfully triggers. So it's not retroactive, it looks. Or maybe it is. I have a few lucky cards in the deck. I don't think so, though. Over Cloud 9? I don't know. I don't think so. Strength. Death. Yeah, yeah, we're just going to death something here. Easy, right? We got the uh, Red Seal Days here. Oh, I get the pick two. Oh. So I could have tried glassing. Yeah, I don't think I would want to anyway. Do I want to just convert these aces to diamonds? Not really. I think I'll set these up to potentially become aces in the future. I think we don't want to go for a flush five because it's going to take too long to set that up. Instead, we'll just keep scaling five of a kind here, best we can. Obelisk. We can't make good use of it, right? Joker, tarot, planet, and spectral cards may appear multiple times. That's very interesting, but it takes up a slot, right? I think it's a no. Oh, I shouldn't have rolled that, probably. Hmm. Retrigger first played card used in scoring. That's a new one, too. Two pair? No. Okay. Just gonna look for five of a kind. I do gotta be careful here and not let high card get too high here, which I might accidentally do at some point, right? Try to play, like, pairs when I need to essentially discard, right? Okay, okay, okay. Earn four dollars at end of round. It does the same thing, right? <laughs> These are all no's. Look for decent aces. I don't know if we bother with that now. What do you think? Yeah, it's probably fine for now. It's iffy. Nah, you still skip those. Gains 0.5 multiplier per discarded a jack this round. That's a no. All face cards become gold cards when played. Fascinating, huh? That's a no. Cards drawn face down after each hand played. That shouldn't be a big deal. Because we can probably figure out what's an ace and what's not here. For the most part, right? Yeah, like this has to be an ace. So I'm sure it's fine. I guess it could have been glass, so I should have moved it to the right. Now, they might tell me to sell a Joker for the final boss blind. We're going to have to pay attention. Oh, wait, unless we're done? Did we win? No, not yet. Sorry, this is the last one. We can't look yet. Okay, never mind. Each played card with club suit gives times 1.5 multiplier when scored. Changes at the end of each round. Oh... So that should be really good with, like, wild cards, right? If you got a lot of wild. I'm going to say no to that one. Right, 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 right. Planet X. Thank you. No. Planet X. Yo! That voucher coming in, too. Wait. Maybe? <laughs> Planet cards in your consumable area. Oh no! I miss I totally misinterpreted this. I needed to hold it over here. Give 1.5 multiplier for their specified poker hand. Oh, I totally misinterpreted that. Okay, then in that case, that voucher is not that great. I should have read it more closely. Ooh, strength is good though. What's that thing? One in four chance to upgrade level of played poker hand. Ooh. 
Is it time to ditch Cloud9 for some... It's uncommon. That sounds fun. Let's do it. Take the strength. A polychrome joke is a no to me. We need kings. How many kings are in the deck? One, two, three, four. Okay, we can play a two pair here. That's fine. So it might level it up. I mean... Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep... That's just a pair, so that's fine. We got to try to fish out some kings here. I might want to get rid of an ace in our hand then. Which means I'm playing high card, which is fine. Maybe even get rid of a pair of aces. I don't think it'll score too high. No, okay. There's one king. Oh boy, I don't know. Uh, play, play, play. Three of a kind is probably too much. This is a pair, which I've played six of. Hmm. I might want to just do the one king. I'm kind of thinking. I don't know what the odds are. Oh, never punished. <laughs> I was going to say, I don't know what the odds are of actually... Here, let's get a big score. Of actually getting two kings at this point in time. Oh, it's going to be juicy. Yo, baby. All right, all right, all right. Oh, I got to look at the boss blind. Priestess. Empress. Forces one card to always be selected. That's not bad for us. That's fine, right? Planet X, thank you. I don't know. One in four chances, huh? Destroy one random card in your hand. Add four random enhanced number cards. No. Add blue seal. If it's held in my hand at the end of a round. It's not great, that's for sure. Empress, High Priestess. This only gives us one planet card. Empress is fine, I think. Rare Joker is a no. Okay, so I'm supposed to hold the queen, right? Ooh. Gonna be my eighth pair, actually. It's fine. Hey, I leveled it up! <laughs> okay. Empress on a couple of aces. All right, what do you got for us? Show me that trigger. Would it sh trigger it ahead of time? I don't know. We got Mars. Oh, right, because I held. I was like, wait, why did I get that? Because I held the blue card. Uh, ooh, ooh. I think I just sell this. I'm never going to play a four of a kind, right? Right? I might use this. I think we hold it after, though. Probably. Justice. Strength is kind of hard. Bonus isn't good. I don't want to really glass. I think we just destroy a couple low cards. What do you think? Oh, I get to pick two, huh? Wheel after that. Come on, wheel! Yo! Let's go, burglar. Burglar, baby. Is there a good reason to buy the standard packs now? Not very good reasons, I don't think. We buy, but we don't use, I reckon. To see if we can get... Uh... Hmm... Play a high card? See if I can get this to hit five of a kind. You know what I mean? There's no point in holding that queen, really. Because uh, the fool's taking up the slot. The pair got upgraded again. Okay, there we go. Good enough. Let's go, baby. Glass is on the right. Again. Big hand. Big hand, baby. There we go. Let's enter endless mode. That is the end of the run officially, though. Well, I'll show you what endless mode entails. It gets pretty wild pretty quickly, though, I'll tell you. Hmm. Oh, nice. We got the Celestial pack here, so it should be guaranteed 
or Planet X. And then we can use the Fool to get another Planet X. So if I hold this here, we get a one and a half times multiplier. Hmm. How worth it is that? Fortune Teller. Space Joker probably isn't going to do a whole lot for us. Can we agree? So I guess I'm keeping an eye out here. Throwback's not very good. I am keeping an eye out to replace it. Plus three hand size is a no. So we, they want 110,000 now. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, we got our five of a kind. There we go. Oh, it worked. We got one. I guess as long as we don't think we're going to get... If we don't need the score right away, you should hold Space Joker, right? To see if you get any value out of it. If you feel like you're doomed soon, that's when you swap, right? I'm kind of only looking at uncommons. For the most part. Venus is bad. No. Hanged Man. It might be kind of worth it to thin out the deck a little bit for long term. I think at this point, a hollow joke. Hmm. Uh, pairs are at nine. Five of a kind is at way more. Pair keeps getting upgraded. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I guess I don't want to play the glass. So maybe I should have. Maybe I should have waited there. 165 is what we needed, by the way. Lovers to make something wild. I don't know. Showman. Showman's interesting here. How does that work with telescope, right? Because it says planet cards may appear multiple times. Does that mean a celestial pack could potentially offer us three planet X's? How? What is the verbiage on telescope here? Celestial packs always contain the planet card for your most played poker hand. Shall we science it? Let's see what we got here. Uh, actually, maybe I shouldn't have done that first. We're fine, it turns out, but yeah. Hmm. I think Chariot on an ace is pretty good here. You might say, why ace? Don't you want to play the aces? Yeah, you'll probably end up holding an ace from time to time. It's uncommon. Let's see. Three planet X's. Ah, we still only got one. So I have had it before, and I've seen it offer the same... Oh, wait, it wouldn't matter, because I only get to pick one anyway. Yeah, what the hell does that do for me? Okay, I'm an idiot. <laughs> uh, no point in taking that. I guess they could offer me a second Fibonacci now, or a Scholar? I guess Fibonacci would be better than Burglar. All spades are debuffed. Okay, we got a three of a kind that we can just get rid of here. Not enough aces still. Okay. Hmm, what do you get rid of here? I mean, obviously, Showman goes first. I'm looking to replace that ASAP. I don't know what... Do you hold that? Is this going to be enough? Two are debuffed? Probably not then, huh? It's probably not going to be enough. Oh, it was enough. It was enough. Oh, it was enough. <laughs> okay. Really wish I didn't end up swapping, huh? No... Strength. Strength. Oh, it offers you two strength. Interesting. Got a bunch of aces in here. Okay, we can just turn a couple into bonus. That's fine. Oh, plus one consumable slot. Yeah, I think it's about time, right? Thank you. Thank God, huh? There we go. Oh, those aren't very good. <laughs> okay, yeah, I really got to replace that soon, huh? Guess I could convert a bunch into... Base chips and multiplier have that need 1.1 million. Oh my god. Well, that's frightening. Guess I'll hold that. So I'm playing a pair. That's fine. 
Uh, yeah. Oh, okay, so I can make this queen gold too, since it's separate from the seal. Okay. So we have these three we can turn. Uh, that might be a mistake because it's a flush five now. Yeah, this is sort of what I was talking about earlier. That's worth less than my five of a kind, I believe. If I could somehow get this leveled up a ton, then it would be better long term, right? Oh my god, it wasn't enough. Oh my. Oh my stars. I see. Okay. Yeah, that's worth way more. Hmm. Yeah, and this is gonna get tough really quickly. As you can imagine. There's no point in playing this as far as I can tell. I'm just gonna sell it. I might need the glass. Hmm. Interesting. Moon. Destroy. I think it's just destroy a couple cards here, right? Just to live, I think we might need to glass something. That's not uncommon. This is uncommon, but it's useless. I'd like to get rid of Showman. Times four multiplayer every six hands played. That might work with Burglar, right? Because I'm going to get a massive score from time to time. That's a voucher, huh? That one's interesting. Go ahead and glass something now, I think. This is going to be a huge hand. Right? With steel and everything here. Double red seals. Baby, one million. The thing is, that's not much better than the score. So we kind of needed it, right? Hermit's nice. Okay. Go ahead and buy and use that. We get to level up five of a kind twice here. Very good. Very nice. Hmm. Reroll. No. 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 Okay. So, I guess it just makes it harder here, right? Play a crappy hand. Okay. I think we gotta play another crappy hand so we can hold that steel. I think. When does this go? Not yet. No point in playing that. I have a kind. Okay. Okay. Oh no, it broke! Oh wow, that was only 590,000? I'm kind of surprised. Uh, I act yeah, I don't want to do a flush five here. Oh right, because everything gets halved. No wonder, of course. Oh, could I lose here? Oh, now the Joker's going off, but it's kind of late. Huh. Yeah, I should have played around the Joker. And conserved some aces here. We might be okay. Times four multiplier. We're fine now. Yeah, I should have played it. Uh, did it matter at the end of the day? I don't know. I guess not. Okay, when blind is selected, destroy Joker to the right and permanently add double its cell value to the multiplier. That's a big no. I think we do like this voucher, though. I think we are about to lose, just FYI. Anti-11 is the kill screen, basically. I'm fairly certain we are about to get absolutely dump trucked. Those are not good. Sell that one. Might sell that one, too. The Fool would generate two more cards. We can convert. Hmm. I get to pick two. Okay, that's actually interesting. Okay. Oh, but we got that in hand. Okay, um... 
Uh, okay, so turn these into bonus cards because this is foiled. It can be both, right? And then we convert with death to get another hollow ace, I think. And then do I fool? I take the fool to get another death card for the next ante. I don't think it'll be enough, truth be told, but... Mul times three multiplier if all cards held in hand are spades or clubs. That's probably too hard for us to get going here. It's all a no. Temperance gives us money. These kind of don't matter. 7.2 million they want from us. 7.2 million, by the way. All right. Keep an eye on loyalty card. So we want to build up a really big hand, if possible, here. For loyalty card. I'm looking. We have 25 of a kinds played, so that's not really a problem. Play this ace, because it stinks. Probably. Two hands remaining. Okay, so this is a good card to convert, I think. Unless I need the glass. I'm not sure. I don't know. No, the red sealed ace is better. Isn't it? Hmm. Two hands remaining. The red sealed has to be way better. Didn't draw it still. I gotta play one more hand. Okay. Okay. Get rid of that ace. There we go. Now the deli's online. Okay, and we and we got this. Okay, so let's convert this 10. I think that's the best one. If it was glass, it would obviously be even better. So one, two, three. Ooh, I gotta make sure I don't do a flush five. Glass at the end. This is probably the best we can do. I know, like, I could have played other hands. I don't know how much it would have mattered. 3.6 million. It was a good effort. And that's with the deli going off. Sorry, loyalty card. That was with loyalty card going off. So our odds of getting out of here alive are pretty much zero now, unfortunately. <laughs> we tried, though. That's endless. This is where they all go to die, it seems. Unless you've really, really worked it out. You know what I mean? Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you had fun. That is Bellatra 1.0. I, I obviously love this game. That was intense. That was interesting. I cannot get enough of it. I cannot wait to play more of it. If you want to see more of it live, I'm probably playing it all this week. Come on over to twitch.tv slash alien. I hope you enjoyed the run. Plan to see a lot more Bellatra for me. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.